Welcome back everyone to Trail Days 2018. We're over here at Farm to Feet and I got David, it's one of the marketing guys. You might remember him last year. He did the same thing with us and did a little walkthrough and told us what's new with Farm to Feet and some new things that are coming down the line. So David's gonna take a moment and talk to us a little bit about that. All right, well, a um, couple things new this year for spring, summer 18. We added two new socks to our AT collection. So a couple, a couple years ago, we launched uh, the Damascus Technical Hiking Sock. Uh, and uh, this year we've added two new socks to that collection, uh, paying homage to the Appalachian Trail. This one here is called Max Patch, it's a three-quarter crew. It uh, has the same foot bottom as the Damascus with the cushioning on the top, cushioning in the heel and the Keeleys, and cushioning in the ball of the foot with extra reinforcement uh, in, the, on the, in those areas as well. It allows for a circulation of air around your foot, but also giving you good comfort around uh, the areas that you most want it. And then the design is really to kind of simulate that 360 degree view you get at Max Patch in North Carolina along the AT. So that's, uh, that's uh, now at the retailers and uh, on farmtofeet.com. The other sock that we, uh, we launched uh, this year is called the Harper's Ferry. Now it's a pretty straightforward sock, but the key here is we named it after the location for the Appalachian Trail Conservancy. And that's why we put the, uh, the AT logo on here. This particular sock, we are partnering with the Appalachian Trail Conservancy and a portion of the proceeds from this sock will go back to the, a the ATC to support conservation efforts for the trail. So when you buy this sock, you're supporting the AT. Awesome. So this year, one of the things we're doing at Trail Days this year that uh, we're, we're really excited about is we uh, want help in coming up with the name of a future Appalachian Trail collection sock. So we at Barn to Feet nominated five locations along the trail. Springer Mountain uh, down in Georgia, Pine Grove Furnace State Park in uh, Pennsylvania, Warwick, New York, Salisbury, Connecticut, and Katahdin uh, the, the, in Maine. And so what we've asked the Trail Day participants to do is to fill out a card and stick their card into one of the jars to vote for what they think should be the next Farm to Feet AT sock. And there will be this sock will come out in 2020. Um, and then once we have a winner there, uh, we will uh, this fall have another contest in which we will ask not only these through hikers who participated, but op open it up to all our followers to help us come up with the design inspiration for the winning sock. And then that that person who gets selected for that design inspiration will have, be able to have uh, the, the, the claim to fame, if you will, of being uh, involved with the design of a, a new part of Pete's sock. And then as an added bonus, all the participants who put a card in here will draw one name out of all these cards and they will win a year's supply of Far to Feet socks, or 12 pairs, one pair for each one. Sweet, awesome. So which place is in the lead right now? Right now, Katahdin's in the lead, and it looks like it's uh, it's, it's gonna probably stay that way. Um, it, it, at the end of uh, yesterday, we had 55 votes um, out of the over 150, 160 votes we had so far. Uh, but you know, uh, it, uh, Springer Mountain's gotten a few more, and uh, a lot of people seem to be really, uh, really hopeful for Pine Grove. They like the uh, that actual physical middle of the uh, AT as being a good uh, name for uh, for a future sock. So we'll see how it goes, uh, and we'll uh, we'll announce the winner on social media next week, and uh, as well as the winner of the, the year supply of socks. And then come this fall, we'll have another contest in which we'll have people help us design it. Awesome. So this fall, when you have your other contest, how can these folks that are watching maybe get entered into that? So I would just uh, follow us on Facebook or Twitter or Instagram, you know, on our social media channels, and uh, we'll announce it on there. If you haven't subscribed to our uh, newsletter, go to farmandfeet.com, subscribe to our newsletter. We'll, we'll send out a, a notice in uh, email. And so there'll be multiple ways uh, through our communication channels that we will tell you that the contest is open and you're able to submit your concept for our new design. Awesome. Well, thanks so much, David. You're welcome. And you have an awesome, happy trail days. Uh, you too. Sounds good. Thanks.